All right, we back with it. Uh, dang, it's been a while, hasn't it? I fixed my camera angle. Hopefully, that's a little more bearable for you today. But before riding season ends, I wanted to get one more video out that I feel is very important to answer a lot of questions that people do ask me a lot. And the main question is content creation. How do you get into it? How do you do it? What do I need? All these questions, I'm gonna answer them all right now. So if that interests you, stick around. If it doesn't, still stick around because I'm also gonna be riding my bike. So there's some free bike content for you too. <laughs> you can just ignore me, pretend like I'm not even here. But for those who are interested, if you're curious about starting content creation, I 100% guarantee that you can succeed in it as long as you're consistent with it and you enjoy it as long as you got those two things you're gonna make it eventually it's crazy somebody told me that once and they're like okay you know if you keep at it and if you enjoy it then eventually you're gonna make it and i didn't believe it and then it happened and i was like okay wait you're right you just gotta do it and then you do it it's super <laughs> it's I, I know it sounds easier said than done but on paper, that's kind of how it is. So let me tell you my story and then I'm gonna tell you some things about moto vlogging and how you can get into that specifically. So I started making content online when I was like, shoot, I, since I can remember to be honest with you. I remember being like eight years old, I would steal my mom's iPhone. It was like an iPhone three or something, iPhone four. And I'd make little vlogs on it. Just me walking around the house or something stupid like that. And then I got into like video games and I like recorded my screen playing Call of Duty. And it was just like, you know, always messing around with it but eventually i made a youtube channel i think the first one i took seriously it was called galaxy glitches it was like i'd play call of duty zombies and post like glitch videos that i found and then my girlfriend at the time found it and my brother found it and i got like embarrassed and i shut it all down right and then i created another one later called dino straw same thing happened people found it i shut it down and then when it took a turn for me was my freshman year of high school whenever fortnite came out as you know uh 26 2017 so yeah 2017 fortnite came out and i created another one and i was like you know what screw it now this is important i was like i told myself i'm not gonna care what anybody else thinks about what i'm doing i'm just gonna do it and enjoy it if I do enjoy it. So I did that, set up my YouTube, set up my Instagram, set up my TikTok, set up my Twitch, all this stuff, and I started posting all of it. And I was having fun, you know, it was a good time. And then people I knew found it. And I was like, okay, this is embarrassing. I was like, you know what? No, I'm not gonna give that, I'm just, screw it. You know, just gonna do it still. And so I did, and I got a little bit of traction on Twitch um, and TikTok, not a ton, but you know, more than I had gotten. So then that, that's the moment when I realized like, okay, this is possible. Like I can do this. And then I decided I got my Scion FRS and started posting car content. And the car content I was posting didn't do good at all. Uh, it didn't do very good, but it, like it was just fun. It was just messing around, you know? It wasn't anything serious, I guess. And so I was doing that. And then I decided to get a motorcycle and I bought my Grom. And I started teaching people how to ride whenever I got comfortable myself. And then that's when it kind of took off and I was like, okay, shoot, here we go. So that's my story. That's how I got to where I am now. Just kept going from there. And uh, sorry, I kind of cut in front of everybody, but it's fine. Um, yeah, so the main thing is like, you just gotta, really just gotta go for it, to be honest. And now a couple things that you'll need if you wanna make motorcycle stuff. This is more catered towards motorcycle things, obviously, because I that's my main thing now. I do still stream on Twitch and stuff like that, but uh, motorcycles are my main thing, obviously, so. But you don't need a ton to get in motorcycle uh, or motor vlogging, sorry. It just depends on the style of content you wanna do. If you wanna do like the classic motor vlogging, you need a GoPro, a GoPro map, and a microphone. And you'd also need a GoPro media mod now to attach a microphone to it. And all that just wires into your helmet. You just gotta kinda figure it out. There's some in-depth videos on YouTube about how to wire it. I highly recommend the Purple Panda microphone. That's the one I use. Uh, there's some other options, some better quality ones, but for $30, I mean, you can't go wrong with it. It sounds nice, it works 50% of the time. So, <laughs> I just think it's kind of cool that like, this is a thing that you can do. Like I do this full time now. And it's fun because it allows me to do what I like to do, which is a big thing I feel like. If you, you know, looking for a career, I'm not gonna say drop everything you have and go make YouTube videos or whatever. I'm never gonna tell you that. 
but you know if it's a hobby you have like try it out if it works it works if you don't like it forget it you can do whatever you want but essentially like this goes beyond content creation like if you want to do you want to be a welder go be a welder you know screw whatever grandpa joe says about it just go do it you know so yeah that's all i gotta say about that i'm just finishing up some christmas shopping so i don't know how long this video has been but uh i'm here now so if I post this before Christmas and my girlfriend happens to watch it, I can't, uh, <laughs> I can't really show where I'm going, but who knows? Actually, I probably wouldn't give it away, but anyways, yeah, so I appreciate you guys for all the support and all that on all the platforms, even Twitch, dude. You guys been blowing it up over there. Is there yeah, there's a stop sign, but yeah, so appreciate it. Thank you for watching this little video. Um, let me know if you have any more questions about all that stuff. I do my best to answer it, but I get a ton of like DMs about like these questions that I've addressed. So I just want to like give a general video what to do and like how to do it and how to get into it and stuff like that if you are curious.